medications can inherently increase your demands for certain nutrients. So because your body is buffering the medications. So if you have a acid reflux problem, uh, oftentimes you'll end up on Nexium, you know, which is uh, a proton pump inhibitor. There's all sorts of different names for these, but what it's doing is blocking the uh, output of acid in your gut. And that's great to minimize reflux but it will actually block your absorption of iron dramatically. It's in the medical aspect of the side effect sheet that comes with the product that you, it can create hair loss because of the lack of absorption of iron. It, you certain times you have to be on medication. There's nothing you can do about it. But if you can minimize some of those medications, like maybe there are prophylactic medications, but if you can minimize some of those medications with your physician under medical supervision, then it may uh, improve your nutrient absorption. So also if there's gut issues, again, I keep saying constipation, diarrhea, acid reflux, these are key symptoms for inflammatory hair loss. But if those exist and your gut is having problems, then you are probably not absorbing the nutrients as well. So you will need more of them in your diet for that to increase.